Tragedy strikes as Massachusetts man drowns while attempting river rescue in New Hampshire. In a scenario that echoes a growing concern across the nation, Franklin High School in New Hampshire finds itself grappling with a shortage of teachers. This predicament has forced the school to make some tough decisions, particularly regarding the availability of certain courses, highlighting the broader challenges facing educational institutions today. Principal David Levesque candidly revealed that the school is currently short of three teachers, a scarcity that has had a direct impact on upper-level math and science courses. This shortage, unfortunately, is not unique to Franklin High School, as educational institutions across the country are experiencing similar issues. The response to this challenge has been twofold. In an effort to continue offering quality education to its students, the school has partnered with Lakes Region Community College. This partnership has paved the way for online classes, allowing students to access courses that might not be available in-house. Additionally, the school is exploring the possibility of integrating courses from the Virtual Learning Academy. It's worth noting that not all subjects have been affected by the teacher shortage. English, social studies, computer science, physical education, music, and art classes remain fully staffed, enabling the school to maintain a well-rounded curriculum despite the setbacks. To accommodate the changes necessitated by the teacher shortage, Franklin High School has made adjustments to its scheduling. The revamped schedule, resembling that of a college timetable, offers longer class periods on certain days, creating a conducive environment for learning and innovation. The flexibility in scheduling has also enabled the school to collaborate more effectively with Lakes Region Community College and engage more deeply within the local community. Principal of X optimism shines through as he affirms that the school is determined to navigate this challenge in a positive manner, leveraging the new schedule to better support the students. While the shortage of three teachers might seem relatively small, its impact is magnified due to the school's smaller size. This underscores the fact that even seemingly minor staffing issues can have significant consequences, especially in tight-knit educational communities. Superintendent Daniel Legallo echoed these sentiments, emphasizing the need for both recruitment and quality assurance in new hires. While the challenge of finding suitable educators remains, the district is actively seeking solutions. The school is open to hiring retired teachers for part-time positions, aligning with the revised schedule to accommodate their availability. As the landscape of education undergoes significant transformations, Franklin High School's approach to tackling teacher shortages serves as a microcosm of the broader educational challenges facing our society. The school's willingness to embrace change, explore innovative solutions, and maintain a commitment to quality education should be acknowledged and admired. The journey ahead is not without its hurdles, but Franklin High School's story reminds us that resilience and adaptability are key to overcoming the challenges that arise in the ever-evolving realm of education. As the school hosts an LRCC informational event to discuss online courses and enrollment processes, it's evident that they are not just striving to address the immediate challenges but are actively investing in the future success of their students. In conclusion, the tale of Franklin High School stands as a testament to the power of innovation and collaboration in the face of adversity. As we collectively navigate the shifting tides of education, we can draw inspiration from their efforts to create a positive and impactful learning experience, no matter the challenges that come our way.